Hello everyone, welcome back to another video lesson. Today's lesson for grade 5, chapter 11, lesson 13. Convert metric units of capacity. Page number is 877. Guys, before starting today's lesson, don't forget to subscribe my channel, Learn Math with Mr. Saad, and also press the bell icon to get notified for every new video. Okay, uh, let us start today's lesson. Uh, to start today's lesson, you guys have to memorize these two things. One liter is equal to 1000 milliliters. So if you are converting from liters to milliliters, you have to multiply by 1000. And if you are converting from milliliters from a smaller unit to a larger unit liter, you have to divide by 1000. Okay. Let us see the first example here. A uh, dripping faucet wastes about 90 liters of water. That's too much if uh, you guys have uh, dripping taps in your house. So you have to fix it because it's wasting 90 liters of water every week. It's too much. So how many liters of milliliters of water is this? Okay. So you guys know that to convert from liters to milliliters, you have to multiply by 1000. 90 times 1000, 90,000. So 90,000 milliliters. Let's move to the next page. Okay, here. Now you have to convert 580 milliliters to liters. So for that, you have to divide it by 1000. And as I told you guys, that if you are dividing, uh, you don't need to uh, follow the process of long division you can just move the decimal okay 580 so you can see that here's no decimal when there's no decimal it means the decimal is in the last here so it's the decimal is here what you will do you will move because it you're dividing so you move the decimal towards left if you're multiplying so you move the decimal towards right okay as we are dividing and we will count the number of zeros three zeros so we will move the decimal three times left one two and three okay so the decimal will come over here point five eight zero zero point five fifty eight uh, as you guys know after the decimal the last zero doesn't have any value if you put zero here or you don't put it doesn't matter okay so i hope you guys understand this thing let's move to the next question uh, let me raise this first okay six liters 6,000 milliliters, 4 liters, 4,000 milliliters, 7,000 milliliters, that is 7 uh, liters. Okay. <clears throat> okay, 42 milliliters. Again, you have to divide by 1,000. The decimal is here. You have to move it towards left because you are dividing and 3 times. So if you move it one time, it will become 4.2. Then you move it another time. Then the digits finished. So you will put a zero here, they put a zero and move it another time. So it will become 0 0.042. Got it guys? I hope you understand. Let me show you here uh, by writing it. Okay. The decimal is here. If there's no decimal, it's always at the end. Okay. So I move it to one time, it will come here, okay. I have to move it three times because three zeros, another time. And now the digits finish, so I will put zero and move it another time. So the decimal will reach here. Got it guys? 0 0.042, 0 0.042. I hope you guys understand this thing. Okay. Let us start, let me erase this and move to the next page. Okay.
<clears throat> okay, 70 liters, 70,000 times 1,000, 70,000 milliliters. 10 milliliters divide by 1,000, move the decimal 1, 2, and put 0, and move it another time, 0 0.01. Okay, uh, from liters to milliliters, so you will move the decimal towards right this time. If you move one time, you have to move it three times because three zeros in 1,000. So we'll put 0 and move it another time and put 0 and move it another time so it will be two zeros at the end 1200 3.5 liters 4000 milliliters again uh, move the decimal one two and three times 0 0.230 this one here you will move the decimal towards right one two put zero and move another time 6210 this one 5000 milliliters obvious 5 liters solve all these questions and match your answers from this video let us move to the next page okay the nail shop purchases nail polish in 13 milliliter bottles so uh, in each bottle the capacity is 13 milliliters and they bought 1,000 bottles, so 13 times 1,000, uh, 13,000 milliliters. And if you convert it in liters, that is 13 liters. Circle the greater measurement. This one, 3 liters, means 3,000 milliliters, more than this. So this one is the greater measurement. Okay. Uh, Emil is challenging himself to fill canteen with water using an eyedropper that drops one milliliter of water so she need uh, if uh, she need 1.5 liter to fill his canteen uh, she need 1500 drops main three items that have uh, you can write these ones or you can choose by yourself i hope you guys understand the lesson don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel, Learn Math with Mr. Saad. And uh, also send me the homeworks through Pioneer. Have a nice day. Thank you so much, guys.